Hi everybody, welcome back to the Big Eye Golf Cornish Quest and today we are at Cape Cornwall Club. Cape Cornwall Club. Uh, so far we haven't done, well we've done okay. We're not doing too bad, we, it was a dodgy par 3. For yeah, us, it, was really. a, it was a tricky, tricky hole. Yeah. Um, and, we so, missed and we missed a birdie putt. And we missed a birdie putt. missed a birdie putt. So we are one, one over. Middle, one over so holes. far? One over. But they say there's plenty of holes left, we've got two par 5s coming up. Yeah, this, this 6, I say, I, I feel are the more scoring opportunity holes Definitely. on the course. Definitely. Wide open expanses, two par fives, we've got a chance. Yeah. If you've not been to Cape Cormac Club before, we've filmed it quite often on the channel. Uh, it's, I guess it's the last uh, golf course on the mainland of the uh, Cornish coast and it probably is, yeah. therefore the southwest of England. Yep. Uh, fantastic little place. Pretty much links, cliff face course. The greens don't hold, you've got to kind of bounce them in. Yeah. Yeah. Um, the wind plays tricks on you, beautiful views. You've got the course. Hotel, 23 pool. rooms, swimming pool, Hello. great for a holiday, great for societies, things yeah. like that. It's, it's, yeah. a great, it's a great base in the area. We've got St Ives nearby, we've got Sennan and Land's End just down the road. And quite frankly, I wouldn't be going to, going to Land's End to stay, I'd be staying here. Yeah, definitely. So, definitely. And they've got good. that um, famous person living in St Just, haven't they? Yeah, me. Yeah, it's, it's just down the road. You can't it's all say in my house. Big is, there, is there a plaque outside your house? There should be a blue plaque outside my house. Yeah, one day there will be when I'm dead. Blue plaque. <laughs> <laughs> so, so we're going to crack on, okay? Sounded good. I'll try and give you a commentary. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's good. That's Chasing good up yeah. the fairway. Nice and safe. Brilliant. The drive neck. We're calling Nick Sensible Nick from now on the channel. If anyone likes to make a comment on the channel and he wants to send it to Nick, I might set him an email up, sensiblenick at whatever.co.uk. Sounded good. We still got the pose. Still looking. Do I get a thumbs up or a thumbs down? Get a thumbs up. Neil, you're going to be very cruel. I am about to be very, very. Because we're just taking the well, you've just taken the tee shots off on uh, hole number seven. Yep. And then um, Nick wants to know, well, you want to know how far further you are than Nick. Nick's a great shot. Wind. Here's Nick. Nick, Here's... do you want to just stand by your ball? Just stand a by your ball a minute, Max. Just don't move it. Just stand by your ball. He's looking at us very confused right now. That doesn't surprise me. He's so, going to be cursed. I wish we had a I know. I know. I better find some more. Uh, some more uh, uh, bleepers and things. And, oh, this where you are. We've bridge got there then. Oh, go on then, go and measure it. Neil's <laughs> getting a Marsy rangefinder out just to see how far he is away. 62. You're 62 yards further than him, are you? Yeah. Honestly, they're like kids. They really are. They really are. I was 234 yards and he was down the middle further. with one of my best tee shots. And Neil was, was 293? Yeah. Up a hill, wind against. And he's on the right fairway this time as well. But then, we, we should we should knock down a few yards for every year different in age, I thought, maybe. Do so you, you want to start bleeping the camera now, a minute? <laughs> no, I'm just trying to help you there, mate. I'm trying to say what you thought you are a bit older than him. I bloody feel it now, I tell you, I feel it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, if you adopt him, then... Uh, I'll adopt him, and I don't mind being beaten by him. You'd still be in a family, wouldn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay, fine. We'll put Neil up for adoption. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry to Neil's mum and dad. Neil's dad watches these, by the way, just what I say. He's a very lovely man. He's an avid viewer. He's an avid viewer. Normally it's, why the bloody hell do you do that? Yeah, he's probably going to make a comment now, having a go at Nick. No, he's probably going to offer him up for adoption. <laughs> he's probably going to say, you're welcome to him. <laughs> okay, shall we carry on, gentlemen? Yes. Right. Right, 185. Yeah, you might just about be able to see the flag on this, but it's just fluttering just above the horizon, actually. Long way to go. That looks very good. Yeah, a little bit right. right. That's good. Okay, round at all. A bit right, but we'll see what that's like when yeah. we get there. Yeah. But this hole is just catching to get it out there. Where's well, a par five? Getting on for a three, isn't it? Yeah. I'm maximising my length, so. Oh, that's pretty good too. There. Slightly left, that one. Yeah, Neil's about right. I'm a bit left. We'll see. But we're up there. Can you give me a five wood, please, mate? That five feet left as well. So we're going to find out what happened, lads. Oh. Let's go. Nick's is up here in the rough, but we've got a very long green. But it is a nice long green to run down to. Neil's is over here. And the problem is, obviously, we want to get close enough to get a birdie here. I'm 
I'm not sure you and I can little things get up and down off of. It's tricky, isn't it? Yeah. So, yeah, I'll probably be able to sort of bounce it. Up to you, lads. You will. Well, we're not as good as that. But you, you make I think decision. that one's better for Neil, and that okay. one's better for you and me. Well, Neil, make the decision then. Uh, will you get close enough with that, Neil? Will you do it? Not that there's any pressure, Neil, but will will you do it? <laughs> I don't know if I... I'm not going to put money on it. Oh, uh, OK. Um, should we take the longer one, then? We'll take the longer one. OK. The, the shorter we one should, is shorter, but it is we should take awkward. This, we should take them both. We'll use this one, see how we get on, and then let's <laughs> no, go and use that no, one, no, see if no, we've made a mistake. No. So after that debate, this is what happens in a scramble. You've got to kind of think this. It depends how confident the best player is. Nice. Come on, come on, come on, a bit more, a bit more. Oh, could do it a bit closer than that, lads. You know, a bit more oomph. They did have a bit of a kick, though. Oh dear. That stalled on that kick, didn't it? I better go and find a club, lads. I'll go up this way. We've got to hold this, otherwise Neil will yeah, never. I know, he'll never forgive us. Yeah. Neil will go on and on about it, won't he? Well, he does. No, don't leave it short. Oh, he's well got done. it. Well done. Well done. Now, shall we see what Neil would have done? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Here's what you would have done, Neil. Hang on, that was a birdie, chaps. Neil wants another go. That was a birdie. Yes, well done. We got a birdie from that one. Let's but, see what Neil would have yeah, done. Yeah, we're going to turn this around and let him have another go. But we are back to level par. Told you this this uh, six would be good. Yeah, put, it, put a marker down so we know where he ended up. There we there. go. There you go, Neil. Tricky old shot, Neil. Prove him wrong, mate. Oh, look at it. Yeah. We made the right decision, <laughs> and in the end, we got the right result. We did, we did. So therefore, therefore it was perfect. Well done. Right, we've got 450 yard par five. Okay. So, we're going out. Yeah, it's an interesting hole. There's a little cut out in the wall, which is a line to go over. Then sweeps out to the left. You go through another gap in a corner shape. Yep. Then you go down and up to the green. That's the plan. Cut the angle slightly. Okay, you're on the left side. You're on the left side, okay. It'll bound down the hill. Fine. I've got to try and go as straight as I can. Otherwise... Otherwise yeah, I know. Otherwise it feels... He does get it wrong sometimes, you know. Not very often. We'll have to go and look. That'll do. That'll be better. Right. That'll do. Not sure if I've saved the day, but it's pretty good. For me, anyway. Well, we're taking Nick's because I think he beat me on the slope, to be honest. Mm. Can't, you can't talk to us now, you've got his microphone. Uh, mine was about 20 yards further up on the left, but on the fairway, I was very happy with it. We're taking Nick's though, well done mate. You'll get his miles out, and do you want to see how far right you've gone? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he will too, look, he will. He 140 will. yards. 140, yeah, exactly, that kind of thing. <laughs> so, we're going to just swing this round. So, in see theory, right. if you were on the other, the top fairway, you would go yeah. through that gap. Um, we're going to cut the corner slightly. I was a bit further up on the right, but again, we've probably cut mm. the same corner. <clears throat> 203. 203 to a plateau green. See the uh, slope? Oh, oh dear. That was awful. Ooh. Look at that. Uh, mm. Well, it's gone forward. Oh. Gone forward. No one to see, no one to know. Could get wider. Well, it will, but yeah. Do you remember that, uh, Hi, that PG Tips advert when they got the. You know, Dad, do you know the piano's on my foot? Oh, yeah. He goes, you know, you want it so oh, and I'll play it. Currently, this tripod is on my foot. <laughs> because I haven't had a chance to actually straighten this tripod up and run out of the slope. So I hope I'm not needed because I've got to move this tripod off my foot. Yeah. Oh, he's chunked it a bit heavy as well. 
you have to tell me because that was going a bit Just low. It's a little bit short. Yeah, kind of up there though. Yeah, one of them will be up there somewhere. I'll say it's a par five, we've yeah. got one just short of the green. And you've got the sea as well and everything. Great shot. Not only is it not a bad golfer, he's not a bad director either, to be honest. No. So, uh, as Nick just said, that's a good idea. We were a little bit short here. By the way, Nick, even my, my duff shot was actually a little bit further than yours. Not it that was, I needed to actually miles here. I but, came down far too steep. And I just didn't I come down at all. Need to get wider. Yeah. So, that's where we are. We're taking Neil's. There's a little bit of slope, but there is a hefty slope there. So I'm going to put the camera up on the back. Old wedge. Oh, Neil, did you uh, mention the other day you hit a flag? I hit the pin. Yeah, you hit the pin at the golf day, didn't you, mate? Yeah. You don't like to talk about it. If you've seen the golf day video or not, yeah, um, you'll find out more. That's a bit big, but is there a slope coming back? Off the back stop? Oh, it never oh. came back. It's just sitting here. Okay. Don't know how that stayed there, Nick. I, I, did, I just couldn't generate enough spin on it. You know. Where's... I mean, if that had just, you know... Spun back. Yeah, just a little tap and it's there. Right. See if John can get inside. Nicely lofted. It's going to come down. Yeah. Not no, bad. That's a good bad one from there. Pretty straight, Neil. Yeah, there's not much yeah. movement on this one. Yeah. Need to hit it. Need it with it. Yeah, I'll try and be clever with it. It's just go straight. I've never been clever with things, mate. <laughs> oh, he's got it. There we go. A little bit right to left there. Ugh. Well, I was trying to be clever, mate. Best bat to bat bird is, <laughs> and we're at one under. We are at one under. I did say there's chances on this this six, so well we done. keep going, lads. Well done. It's definite chances, and a hole that we all contributed to. Again, yeah, that's the good thing about a scramble. Some people say I don't contribute enough. I think I am. There we go. Carry on. I reckon you'll be hit with a pitching wedge. Yeah, I reckon you've got a chance, don't you? So that's the plane to the Isles of Silly. I don't have too much pub, but I don't mean the scramble. Everyone came on short. So we are on what hole? This is the ninth hole. Ninth hole, okay. 162 yard par three. Okay. We're playing off a mat. Playing off a mat, so it's playing 148. Okay. Um, which is playing up over this old Cornish hedge. Yep. We've got big curved bunker on the left, little bunker on the right hand side. Apart from that, if it's straight, you're doing okay. It is, yeah, yeah. It's quite a tricky green to hold. This it's one. a lot more deceptive. You think this one? Yeah. I've hit this one and not. I thought we were going to get there and never got anywhere near it. Yeah, it's deceptive. Left. Just a little bit left. On left and long. Okay. Hit the wall. Hit the wall. Do you want me to leave that there? Please? That's fine, I'll probably get him straight from the back. Corner shedges are useful when you have to hit them with back walls, back stop. Mm -hmm. so. Staying outright as well. I thought that would come in right to left. Yeah, pretty good for distance, but yeah. the wind never moved it. Okay. No pressure, but don't let us down. Only person that yourself down at me, mate. Right. Oh, that's not bad. Come on, kick it. Go. Go. No, no, no. Short, no stop. Want to stop. Oh. stop. Now stop. No, it might, might be just before the bunker. I think it might have rolled in. They're all kind of there and thereabouts, isn't they? Yeah. So, mine ended up in the bunker. Neil's ended up here. Guess who we're taking? Neil's, of course. Okay, so. We're both there and thereabouts. It's okay. Nick found his. Good all distance. good. 
Oh, uh, dink on the green. Little dink on the green. Go on. Oh, no. what? Go on, do it. Put your eyes in the air. There we go. Oh. Uh, whatever we said about him, we'll take it I, all back. I was going to do that. Yeah, you were, yeah I'm going to do it after as well. Yeah, I know. Well done. Well done, Neil. Well done. Exactly. Yeah, crowd. Crowd. Pull. Yeah. What can I say? Just walk off. Exit. Stage. Whatever. So, um, Nick, Nick just got in his buggy and said, well, that was three birds in a row. Yeah. And uh, we weren't expecting that one. That's not fair. I mean, I'm sure when you play golf, you were intending to get in the hole, aren't you, with the second yeah. shot? I, I, yes. just, I didn't expect that. It turned into a bit of a par three special. You may not be expecting it, but quite frankly, well done, Nick. Look, there we go. Well done. Well done, my friend. Excellent. Well, so we are now... We're firmly on a birdie train at the moment, aren't we? Two under now, I believe, are we after? Breathe in. Ah, yeah, breathe in. Camera's going through. Little little gap in the hedge. Yes. Stroke so, the ball. So that's what we know. We're now two two under. Two under. Two under. Two Start under. with just six, one over. Yep. We're doing very well. I know. Calm down. Calm I down. Know. Adrenaline Adrenaline's still going. going now. I know. So tenth hole. Tenth hole. Two hundred and forty yard par four. Okay. It's, I say it's reachable. Nick could probably get there with the driver, yeah. with a good one. Well, he could. Yeah. No, no, no laugh, we've, Nick. We've been... Nick, no doubt. You're doing very well. I know. You're doing I very know. Well. It's just when I hit a best shot. I know. Oh. Yeah, I know. But you would have chipped that in as well. I would have. He, he, exactly. Had no chance. I would have done it. Yeah. I'd have nined it. Nined, nined it. Dinky nined it in. We got a bunker short of the green. Yep. Um, I think it's like 80 yards short. Then we've got two bunkers left and right. Okay. Green, sli green slightly raised. So just get it out and get it straight. Yeah, well, it's just getting it up there as close to yeah. the green as possible. There's a wall on the right hand side. I think you can actually play from the other side of the wall up, can't you? There's no actual out of bounds. No, no, you, you can. If I, you I needed have, to, but I we don't want to. Yeah. That's very good. Beautiful drive. That's a beautiful drive. As long as it avoids the bunker. Yeah, that's, that's in good stead. There you go. Excellent. Can I just say, Neil, don't go 60 yards past my tee shot. Well, I'm you might go over the back if he does, <laughs> let's be honest. So it's all right, they've got the Mizuno pairs here next week, haven't they? I think by the time we get this out. They're going to have a lot of fun on this course. They really are. Now, I know he's gone a little bit right to the left. Do you notice he's got hybrid out or something? Gone a little bit left, Neil? Yeah. In that thick stuff left of the green. Oh, that's not very good, is it? You did get the driver out there, you know. It's a better position. Okay. Don't need me though, because I mean, yours is very good, Nick, I think. Mine is very good, thank you. There you go. Let's carry on. It's nice to contribute. Well done, Nick. Yeah, you thank you. That well? Yeah. Yeah. I won't say that all the way along in the buggy, he was going, well, we could take mine. Mine's only just over there. We could ship it it's... out. I said, I'm not getting involved. I'm not getting involved. No, Neil's, like wasn't a bad... Neil's wasn't a bad shot, actually. It ended up all right, didn't it? So, we got a chip right. onto the green, yeah? Oh, hang on. Oh, no, no, no. Ooh. Did Ooh. it really bounce myself? Oh, didn't really, yeah. Didn't really happen, did it? No, it didn't really get through it enough. No, okay. Need a more commitment. Well, I've often been told that myself. I don't commit <laughs> enough. Most, most of my wives always said I never committed enough, to be honest, but yeah. Well, that could work now. Better. That's nice. Oh, he's not. He's not bad, you know. Is he's he? not bad. No, he's, he's not, not bad, bad, is he? Really. We taught him everything in. You know. Oh, this is your bread and butter. This is. Well, it's not really. I've got a seven in my hand. Oh. It's your Melba toast. This one. Yeah, it goes way over the back there. It's worked not out bad. really well. Oh, not bad at all, Oggy. Well played. I think you're probably inside yours, but you just got me a little bit, yeah. there, yeah. That's why I went for the stem because there's a lot more ground to cover. Good shooting. Good shooting. But, so I'm filming it from here, because you can kind of see the distance we're playing with. Probably about 12 feet, 12, 14 feet. Which is which? Who's closest, lads? Take yours. Oh, thank you very much. Right, I'm going to walk over here. Not sure what the slope is like for the actual part, but. 
just leave that flag in? You can't do, yeah, leave it here. That way then, yeah. Yeah, it's got to be two or three inches outside left. Just, just outside. What's a great putt. Look at that. Four in a row. Okay. Great putt. Thank you very much. Four birdies in a row. Four birdies in a row. Shall we carry on, lads? So what happened there, Neil? Another birdie. Another birdie. So we are now three under. Three under, four birdies in a row. Four birdies in a row. We've got, this is the last hole. Yeah. Isn't it? Of this part? Mm, no, no this is hole 11. Two holes left. Yeah, we've got one of the fun holes to go. Yeah. So 300, sorry, 298 yard par four. Okay. Big bunker. Yeah. 35, 40 yards short of the green. It's quite a straightforward hole. You've got a lot of expanse left and right. Yeah, you just want to avoid that bunker going in, don't yeah. you? But probably about 10, 20 yards out back of the green. Yeah. You've got a hedge. So, you have. Yeah. Cornish hedge type thing. Yeah. So we're just going to get them out there and hopefully get a second shot. It's, it's a it's difficult usable. green to hold your second it shot is, on, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. 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 That's very good. That's lovely, mate. Bouncing, bouncing. Great drive. Great drive. Great drive. Yeah. I'm not needed now. Well, you might be because we still might have to go over the bunker with that one. Yeah, but that, I'm, I wouldn't, I know Neil I wouldn't get past that because my best drive gets about as short of that bunker. So, mm, yeah. We're going to take yours, Nick. We don't know, no, hang on. Keep going. Keep going, Neil. Can we get the miles out and measure how far <laughs> <laughs> mine and Neil's got? Yeah, I would. <laughs> oh, that was awful. Go on. Hey, you've done enough. You've done plenty today. So, we're taking Nick's, obviously. Um, but we are thinking there might be an issue about the flag being too near the bunker, maybe? Yeah, yeah. I think we might not be able to go to okay. the, the flag. Well, let's let's um, get it on the green first, we'll deal with the yeah. And Do you know what, on that last hole, it was just you and me, we didn't let Neil play at all. No. We, we've got to let him have a go now, we don't want to shatter his confidence, don't we? Give him the first first attempt, do you? 76 yards. Okay, Down I'm going to move his back, so you're probably going to be a bit high, you lot. Downwind, firm I green. I don't know if I can stop it, Neil. But... Well, just get it on the green. I don't mind where on the green. It'd go be high. a four or a three, depending on where we land, isn't it? That's very high. Not and very short. Yeah. Okay. No. You went for the big high. Yeah, I'm just thing, not didn't quite you? capable of doing that shot, unfortunately. Okay. Maybe it was me thinking Dick was going to play sensibly and get us on the green. Just trying to try to go for the heart of the green. Yeah. Right? Heart of the green would be fine right now. Getting right of the Long. Green, but... Mm. Uh, the head was trying to... This isn't fun, is it, lads? Head was trying to hit it high. Okay. Sit. Sit. Just off the back. Off the back. Just off the back. Good effort. Good effort. Yeah. So, what happened, gentlemen? You're taking mine. Taking we yours. Are. Okay. Well played, Augie. It didn't hold the green, but it's literally on the edge of the fringe. Yeah, there's not much get. else you could do on it. I mean, and look at the slope. Yeah, and look at the slope. Here. So, it's a long putt. If you get this in two, got to be happy, Jed, but I think we are. I think, yeah, go for the par. That's yeah. what you've got to do. Go for the par. Okay, so have a little chat about things. Do you want to go first, lads, as I'm holding the camera? I don't really mind. Should the camera out? Sorry? Do you want to go first as I'm sitting there with the camera or standing there with the camera? Uh, I'm, I've got quite a walk back to forwards, that's all. It's going to be a long old putt, isn't it? Over, is it? That didn't really move much. You don't want to come around here, is it? Yeah. Could be nice. Not coming down again. Isn't that weird? Yeah. We all saw it differently, don't and I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but that's where we all end up. It looked like they were gonna move a little bit more than yeah. that, but no, that's okay. Yeah. In that distance, it's not gonna play around too much, is it? Feels a tiny bit right to left, but we'll see. Okay. Oh, a little tiny bit right well to that, doesn't it? Well Excellent, done. Nick. Well done. Well done. So, that's a par. Yep. Now we're off to the 12. The fun oh. stuff. The well. fun starts now. It really does. 
We're off to the 12th, everybody. And I've seen Oggy <laughs> get that on two before. <laughs> yeah, I know. I love the way he builds me up to knock me down. I know, honestly. Well so, welcome to hole number 12. Hopefully you better see it. Down there. The stunning hole. It really is. I'm trying to show it a little bit easier on a bit more footage. But Nick's down there. We're playing off the yellows. There was a white at the back as well. It's going to be fun, isn't it? I, mean, I love I love to make him talk when he's got a mouth full of trail mix. Look at it, look at it now. Yeah, lovely. Beautiful, isn't it? I mean, here's it's where the course really starts to yeah. get to get some um, where's the fairway. Yeah, it's like it's like it's kind of lulled you into a false sense of security with those yeah. birdies, and now it's going to hit you hard. Stunning place, though. What a view. What a location. Okay, so okay, Neil. the 12th, 249 yard par 4, it looks like you're teeing off into, into the blue yonder. Nothing, yep. You've got about 120 yards, there's a marker post which de denotes where the start of the fairway sort of is. There's 222 to the pin from here. So you want to be about 180 yards and you should be able to get a lot of run down there. A lot Towards of the green, yeah. Especially in the dry conditions like this. Yeah. But it's fantastic, that looking hole. Problem is, anything runs very badly left here. You know, never it does slope again. right to left. The green sits on a little bit of a sort of plateaued off at the back. Slightly so. yeah, at the back. Yeah. There is no. a bit more space than you think on the right hand side, but that wall is protecting the road that goes down to the bottom yeah. of that car park. It does open up. It does. So you don't really want to be going straight out of the green, you want to be going right of the green. Yeah. But again, if that's scary, right, especially if you're playing from probably up on the white, mm. it's more scary at the top. I've played yeah. up there. There is a footpath that sort of curls up around towards yeah. the side of the cape there. That's where you want to be aiming, really. Okay. That's absolutely lovely. Beautiful, Nick. I don't think you could do better than that, mate. Just to the right. That looks so good. We haven't let Neil play, so we got uh, hope he does a good one now. We well, you've done a really good one, mate. We don't want to ruin his don't confidence, worry. do we? He's a crappy one. And he can get there with us. Just a... Great strike, Neil. To slightly right to the left, maybe going straight at the flag. Might be going left a little bit. Just gone off the back of the green left. On the left, yeah. Looked like it was just curling, didn't it? Nice try. What club I'll have to have a go, won't I? Follow by. Oh, all right. Come around. Hey, come around. I think it's space around there. It just, it just feels like it's going to the yeah. wall, doesn't it? So, this is where Nick's ended up, which is the one we're going to take. Neil's gone over the back, they're still looking for it. Not really going to find it, that view. Amazing, isn't it? Um, mine was a bit short up on the top on the right, so I didn't really get into any trouble. That's the next hole we're going to play down there. And this is the serious stuff you can bounce down this slope into if you get it wrong. But Nick, I think you pretty much got it right. Well yeah. done. Quirky little one, isn't it? You were saying that you thought this used to be a bunker, it's been filled in, but I can't remember it being sad then. I've only ever seen it like this. It was a deep bunker. Yeah? It was about four and a half, five foot face. Oh, okay. Every time I've ever seen this place, it's always kind of been grass in there, so. But it's still got the same kind of effect. Yeah. Ball above the feet. Tricky thing to play. Carry on, mate. They're on quite a slope. That's nice. That's okay. That might come round, but uh... nice. Hey, we're in play. That's that's the good thing about this hole. We could have all been in some serious mess. It's a better angle. Oh, nasty oh, kick though. Stay there, though. Stay there. Stay. It stayed. That was on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Right. It was between the two like last, but yeah. stopping was hard, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. It's alright, we've got, we've got a putt for a birdie we've still. A putt for a birdie, yeah, yeah. Thank you. So we're taking Neil's. It's a bit of a slope, we think, probably right to left as I can see it. Uh, if I remember right, this one is pretty straight. Yeah, I think it's okay. Just, yeah, a tiny bit from the right, but pretty straight, you're right. Just that downhill bit, isn't it, is the problem. Oh, it just got a little bobble, think, didn't it? I think. I just caught the uh, the ground first. Yeah. 
Oh, 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 I thought you had it. I thought you had it. Well, it's closer, but you know, no cigar. Okay. There we go. Oh, so we got four. That was a four. And welcome to the end of part two. Look, it doesn't matter. Four, four birders in six holes. That's got to be entertainment, hasn't it? I know. I Look at the view. Under. Beautiful place. Thank you very much to uh, all the members and the staff and everyone at Cape Cormac Club for allowing us to come and film today. It's a great day. We're having a fantastic time, and this course is beautiful right now. Come and play it. Anything else to say, lads, very quickly? Oh, oh, I think that's a lovely three. course. Part three will be good. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we've had, we've had, what, four birdies? See if we can get we some did, more on the back. We've done line. really yeah, well. We've had a few other opportunities. In fact, this, this was probably the easiest hole, and we didn't birdie it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wasn't it? Yeah. So we, we've done well. That's okay. And it's a nice hotel, looking at the position up there. Beautiful, isn't it? Views over here. I mean, it's a great place. Can't great go wrong. Place. Just, just sweep it back towards the sea, and we'll see you in part three. Honestly, I know most of you don't watch part three, but Neil, yeah. seriously, they have to watch part three, don't they? The first hole on part three is a fantastic little part three. And the second hole is a killer. Can yeah. destroy a round in one go. Just, just watch it. Honestly. It's going to be entertaining, whatever. It's going to be entertaining, whatever. Come and watch part three. But four birdies on part two. Part three, you'll, part three you'll see. Where's the fairway gone? Exactly. Where's the fairway gone? Where's the ball gone? Where's everything gone? Where's the score gone? <laughs>